<laughs> Hello guys. <laughs> <laughs> We're out here putting in work, shooting a video. We're going to teach you guys how to manual the easiest way, the way that we all learn. Um, we've got some good tips. <laughs> I see you, Kizzy, don't worry. We've got some good tips, and um, yeah, I hope you enjoy the video and I hope it helps you learn to manual. Sweet. Manualing is it. It actually teaches you a lot of stuff while yeah, being yeah. on the back wall. Like yeah. You know how far to go back. You know? It helps your, it shows off your balance and control of the yeah, bike. Yeah. And the fact it that you... It shows your understanding of yeah, being like, on the back wall. That you can just coast and yeah. use your body weight and your balance point to keep a wheelie going without pedaling basically. So. It's mad to think you can actually keep the wheel and up it's what, just by balance. To, to learn, learning that balance point to be able to manual is what allows you to do all the other tricks like standing in a seat and manually. Yeah, frame. You gotta learn that balance point and learn how to use the brake whilst <laughs> shifting your body weight around the yeah. back. So the manual is key to what we do. It's not really used a lot. You don't really see it on its own much. You but do. it's like there hills, a lot. Downhills it's used yeah, a lot. Yeah, downhills. But I mean like everyone's always putting tricks yeah, with it. Yeah. But the actual manual, you don't see it a lot, but it is always involved in what we do. So yeah. it's a good one to learn and that's why we're teaching you. So yeah. Out. Yeah, so step one is a uh, real important one. What is step one? The lift. <laughs> so step one, the lift. the lift. So how to lift? Everyone does it probably a little bit different, right? Yeah, yeah. But the whole general idea of it is the same as where you want to have your body weight pretty central over the bike. Mm -hmm. And you want to be able to shift your body weight backwards. And as you lift the front wheel, <laughs> Doing a good job. Support. Yeah. Come on. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> so, the first thing I do when I do a manual is I get my body weight to the centre of my bike. I want to have my balance. I want to be straight on the bike. Control. I always put one foot, whatever my stronger foot is, I put it forwards, almost at a right, almost parallel to the floor. But as soon as I put the manual up, I normally keep it a little bit up, just like there. So that's the position in which you want to now pick the front wheel up, mm. is when you're in that position. So guys, if you're left footed, you would put the you put the left foot left you put the left pedal. So in front. if you're right footed, you put the right you put, pedal. You want to put it almost parallel, but I tend to have mine just yeah. a little bit up. Like fi say 50 50. I'm gonna show you. I'm not going to show you how I pop it up into a normal manual, but I'll show you the first steps in which I took to learn the manual. Yeah. And so, as I was saying earlier, or like 10 seconds ago, <laughs> I've got myself into this position where I'm standing over the bike and going straight and I'm controlled. I've got my body weight central and I've got my pedals at that sort of little up, little down angle. And then at this moment is when you go, you want to shift all your weight backwards? Yeah. He's just showing you how to lift it, basically. Yeah, yeah. Go on, Soups. Show them on a the fat ripper. <laughs> so, that's the sort of first steps you're going to take. You're not going to be confident enough to be going too fast yet. And you want to learn how to just get your body weight back Get your bum over the back wheel a little bit and lean back and make sure all your body weight is there to be able to pump as soon as you get into your balance point. Next step is getting it to your getting it to the balance point and having the back brake. If that makes sense to you guys. So yeah, once you get up, you're gonna need to get up to the balance point. And to stop it from going further than the balance point, you're gonna have to use the brake. But then when the wheel starts going down, do you then use your 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 booty. Yeah, yeah, your booty. <laughs> booty. <laughs> booty. <laughs> to push your To pull it back, back up. Yeah. To, to pull shift it back up, all your body weight. You need the back brake again. Yeah. So it's just long circle. Trying to keep it, yeah. pumping it and tethering that back brake. Yeah. How did you learn to get it to the balance point? I literally, I used to just go really fast. You used to go fast. Yeah, speed help. Yeah, speed help. Well, that's for me though. But yeah, it helped me too. I would yeah. say. I said I literally just go fast, and I keep my legs straight when I when I bring it up. Straight. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. And I literally like stand on it straight. Like I literally just like say my feet were still on the pedal. I'd be straight. Yeah, yeah. 
and then use my back weight. I wouldn't like use my body movement. You wouldn't? No, that's when I first started. Oh yeah, you yeah. would just try and coast it. Yeah, so I just yeah, tried to coast yeah, it. So these lot at that time, so they're saying that their next step was not being able to use the body weight to keep it up, but being able to get it to the balance point and just coast the bike. Use like the literally bike just yeah. coast it and see how far you can go with just keeping them? your body weight there. Do you want to show them? Because I think that's probably how everyone gets to that stage. Yeah, come. See how he's just coasting there. So once you put in the hours, getting it to the balance point and coasting, the next step to the, the manual is probably the last one. As long as you've worked hard and put in the hours, like it, it's not, it's not an overnight thing for it's, sure. Them, like, them two steps that we've just showed you, if you practice and practice and practice, them two steps, you've got manual. Yeah, like much, that's the it. next step is what would complete the whole manual yeah, overall. Yeah. And to keep to help you keep your distance and to add some style to it, but the first two steps are yeah real important. The main, the main so yeah, the third step is now shifting your body weight oh, yeah. and oh, use yeah. actually yeah, using that back weight and your arms. Yeah, so your yeah. arms come into play as well. You want to use your body weight and be able to shift your body weight to keep the bike going as far as you can without pedaling. Mm -hmm. So the third. And final step to being able to manual is what we just explained. So right now, I'm going to show you what Kizzy. Do you want to give them a demonstration, not manualing, just of the sort of movement yeah. that they want to want to do? You Whilst like rolling, your, rolling, do it rolling, do it rolling. Your body in certain positions. You want to, to keep, the keep it over the back wheel, right? So I'm not going to lift the wheel or nothing, but you want to be being like able that, to pump it, it. yeah. Like maybe not that exaggerated. <laughs> like, like it might not be that exaggerated. It might not be that exaggerated. It's it's where you feel comfortable with your yeah. weight behind over the back of the bike, basically. So when you're feeling like you're gonna come down, you, you wanna lean back a bit more. You pump it back. You push yeah. your hips back. Then when you're going too far back, you can bring it bring, bring it your weight forward. forward. And you can yeah. use the back brake to bring you forwards as well. Yeah, that's yeah. what I do. Well, and then when I come forwards or if I'm cruising and I want to try and keep my speed, I'll try and do it. I won't try and lean back too much, I'll be just trying to pump yeah, yeah. with my body weight in that same just position. Just up. like, if I'm imagining it as if there was a line, yeah? Like a line across my body. Yeah. If I'm like manually straight, I want to keep my body weight on that line, like my bum on yeah, that yeah, line, yeah, pushing yeah, it back. Yeah, that's yeah. it, yeah, yeah. If I, that's it, that's it. If I, like I just thought of it, no way. Yeah. <laughs> yeah? And if you're going a bit too forward, Imagine that line, you want to now get your bum and your body weight at an angle to that line. Yeah. Like, to the to point where you want to get that back to, to the point where you want to keep your body back, body weight back to that straight line and keep it parallel. And if you're going too far back, you can also bring it forward, yeah, yeah. but more time you can just use the back weight to bring, bring your body weight back to that central Sometimes position. Sometimes you press it too much. Algebra thing. <laughs> I mean, mathematics educational thing. <laughs> man got even English, you know. So, what? Show them some manuals now. Yeah, Give them some examples. Show them some, the, the, the best. Fire manuals. The long ones. The big ones. The big ones. For the big bikes. For the fat bikes. The funny ones. So many manuals to do. No foot manuals, <laughs> one hand manuals, leg over frame manuals. There's so much to do. But they're not the classic manual where you're no. trying to pump with your weight. They're more about coasting. Yeah, they're more like trick manuals. It's still, it's still the, a manual. Once, you've, once you can manual, them tricks are going to come like that. They're going to come yeah. like, you're going to have two months of pure progression. You'll be manual. You'll be manual. <laughs> and it is true. You'll, be and you'll just be able road. to start taking body parts yeah. off the bike. And you'll be like, I can put my leg over here now because I can manual. I can yeah. put my leg over there now. Like, yeah, exactly. Like, so I'm going to show you some manual. And I want to see you guys manualing. I want to. Tag us in the Insta clips and that. Yeah. Yeah. So yeah, sweet. Ha <laughs> ha.
<laughs> yeah, there we go. See what? That was probably the longest one you've ever done. You're telling me I can't, he can't manual. That was look, like, he's crying. He's so happy. <laughs> <laughs> yes, yes, me. Yeah, come on, more, <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. No. Rich, so you can. I think. Do you know what happened? Ah, okay. We didn't show you an example of what Mitch was like before. Yeah. But that was the longest one Mitch done. Mitch will listen to uh, us. Yeah, lot. he did. I he think did. in the background I was fixing that punch, and yeah, Mitch was. Him. You know, he had that. Had the ears open. He was listening. Yeah. Uh, Cleaned him out this morning, wasn't it? <laughs> 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 he's just done his longest one. Like, genuinely, so... I hope this video helped. It's been a good day today. It's been a really good day, day, even though you're stuck in East London. Well, we all got a ride back, so it's yeah. not just me. I'm just like... You know what? Miles. I'm just like... It's just you, bro. Like, I wasn't even thinking about the journey home. And you just keep, you just keep putting it in my brain cells. Yeah, yeah, but do you know what it is? Do you know why it doesn't matter? Because we just provided... Nice tutorial video for the the family. It's for a good cause, isn't it? Like yeah. For a good cause. Two hour journey. Huh? Two, two hours. Hour. <laughs> That's oh, not yeah. two hours. He, he's got to do double miles. my mileage. So I'm doing 8.8, .8, he's doing 15. Uh, can you please times 8.8 .8 by 2? Yeah, but basically. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, wait, wait, wait. Whoa, what whoa. it does. So yeah, when you pick the front wheel up, you want to shift all your weight. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah. Still got Mitch in the car. Um, <laughs> Let me get to 65, we're going to be here for a little bit. <laughs> it's alright. Next yeah. time, um, no interruptions, please. <laughs> <laughs> the lift. The lift. <laughs> that was so bad. Wait, take two, take two. What's the thing, yeah? Press it. Yeah, so it goes. What's um step one? Step one is the lift. The lift. Oh. Oh no, no. Oh. Take two, take three, take three, take three. So today guys, we're gonna have a bit of serious. We have a bit of that. <laughs> 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 oh, I can't stop now, man. <laughs>